Welcome to Auto Motor Reviews. Today, we'll shift gears from engines on the road to engines in the sky, as we explore what is known, and speculated, about the 2026 McCoyan MiG-41, also known by its project name PAC-DP. 1. Project Overview and Purpose The MiG-41 is a next-generation interceptor aircraft project by Russia's McCoyan Design Bureau, intended to succeed the aging MiG-31 in Russia's air defense fleet. As a Product 41, Isdalai 41, design, it is often dubbed MiG-41, though no official designation has been formally assigned. Its core mission is to intercept high-speed threats, including hypersonic weapons, reconnaissance drones, and possibly low-orbit targets. 2. Performance Claims and Technical Ambitions Speed and Altitude Russian sources suggest the MiG-41 could reach speeds of Mach 4.0 to Mach 4.3, roughly 3,300 to 3,500 miles per hour, with the possibility of pushing toward Mach 5 in future iterations. To support those velocities, ramjet or turboramjet propulsion is frequently proposed. It's also claimed to operate in near-space altitudes, soaring above the stratosphere, possibly in atmospheric layers that conventional fighters cannot reach. Stealth and Survivability Features The MiG-41 is said to integrate stealth features, advanced radar absorbent materials, and reduced radar cross-section design philosophies. There are also claims of anti-missile laser systems or directed energy defenses to counter incoming threats. Some versions may even be partially unmanned or optionally piloted, leveraging autonomous or AI-assisted control. Weapons and Interception Role the primary role is interception, including hypersonic missiles, airborne platforms, or satellites in low Earth orbit, as some claims suggest. The aircraft might carry long-range air-to-air missiles, possibly in internal bays to maintain stealth, and it may use multi-stage interceptor missiles or submunitions to increase kill probability. 3. Development Timeline and Challenges Schedule Aspirations some announcements put the first flight around 2025, with entry into operational service around 2028. However, those timelines are considered optimistic by analysts. Technical and Industrial Hurdles Achieving sustained hypersonic flight demands cutting-edge materials, advanced cooling systems, and reliable high-speed engines, all extremely difficult engineering challenges. Russia's history with producing and scaling advanced fifth-generation jets, e.g. Su-57, shows repeated delays and difficulties, casting doubt on their ability to leap to sixth-gen capabilities on schedule. Sanctions and supply chain restrictions further complicate access to advanced electronics, precision tooling, and composite materials. Some critics even label the MiG-41 a Potemkin fighter, more a piece of strategic messaging than a realistic weapon platform.